told you to walk him an hour ago! Mom, no! Coming! What's this? A letter? For me? The name's Jondas. What are you doing here? I'm here to take you to grocery school for the Magically Inclined. How are we getting there? Well, there's only one way to grocery school for Magically Inclined. That's in this baby right here. I'm supposed to just leave all this behind? And just go with you? Yep, that's pretty much it. Hop in. Start at magic school. When's my first day? There aren't really days in Magic Land, if you know what I mean. It's more like a, a concept of time on a plexiglass flex plate theory <laughs> based on the expanding universe's 3D palette. Crazy. <laughs> yeah, man, I'm getting kind of hungry. Uh, I've been driving for a while. You want to uh, stop at Wendy's? Wendy's? It's Wendy's. You never heard of Vicky's? No. What's the craziest thing you've ever done with a wand? Well, I can't tell you that, but I can give you a hint. Back when I graduated in two. Um, well, let's just say the cow jumped over the moon, you know what I mean? And it ain't ever jump over the moon again. Here. This is the school for the magically inclined? Yep, that's the entrance right there. Just walk down that gravel path. Well, thank you very much, sir. And uh, here's your uniform. A uniform? Oh my god. And uh, my spectacles. very own spectacles. Thank you, Jaundice. What is this place? We've taken note of your abilities and you've been selected for an elite training program for wizards. I'm a wizard? You're not a wizard yet. I don't understand. My parents always told me I, I was worthless. I, I would amount to nothing, but here I am, standing in front of you and you're telling me I'm a wizard? There's a lot of training that goes into this process. Okay, when do I start? Oh, what a coincidence. You have a class in 10 minutes with Professor Wumblestein. Don't be late. He has a no-tolerance policy for tardiness. Yes, yes, Headmaster. I, I, I'll go right now.
Spencer Berkowitz, my boy, our resident celebrity. Welcome to potions class. Come on in, maybe you'll learn something. Oh, I said. Hi, I'm Hermione. Nice to meet you. You can call me Herm for short. <laughs> Crikey! Spencer Berkowitz! Am I supposed to be a dress code here? No. You ever try my mom's pumpkin leaf and juice? It's so good, you should try it. Welcome to class. Today we're going to go through potions. Some of the most majestic. The Dragon Eye Potion. Pay attention. The Love Potion. One of the most dangerous in the class. Be careful. Don't jostle my beautiful pixie. And finally, the Potion of... <clears throat> now, I have acquired some different things. This is freshly ground dragon bone. I'm going to add that. And then I prepared before today's class the secret ingredient that makes the living death work. And that's the liquid iridium. The liquid iridium is a golden potion. And you'll notice that upon adding this, death comes from anyone who drinks this. It's black, like your soul will be. But it doesn't work unless you have this. Liquid iridium! It's a golden liquid, and one drop will give you magic powers. One drop, and thinking about a creature will give you the best part of that creature. But only one drop, because if you have more than that, there's extreme side effects. We're going to brew this today, and the person and group that brews the best potion will have what's remaining of the liquid iridium to use as they see fit. You may all begin, except for you, Spencer. Come with me. I know you're a bit fucked up, but everybody needs a little help from time to time. Do you? All right. You've got gifts. I know that you levitated a pencil. First try. It took me 12 years to master that spell. This is a special wand. Might give you a little bit of a leg up. All right, why don't you take that, see if it helps you. Spencer, can, can we be partners? No, you want to be partners with me. Uh, no, 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 Spencer, come on. No, you you want to be you want to be Obviously, he wants to be partners with me. With that? Sorry, Hermione. I think I'm going to be partners with Sam. This is Bullix! This is Bullix! This is not fair! You ready to be in? Yeah. Touch tips. Good. Stir carefully, the book says. With a wand. Yeah, perfect. I think we're good. I think we're good too. Yeah. Professor Wombleseam, I think we're ready. Can you taste test? Well, it's frowned upon to taste test liquid death, but you can smell the death. This seems perfect. Look at that black color. You've done a phenomenal job! This is one of the best evidences of liquid death I've ever seen. You, I suppose, were just sitting next to him this entire time. You've won the liquid iridium. Congratulations, use it wisely. Remember, one drop only. More than that, and the effects are unpredictable. Congratulations. Thank you, Thank Professor. You know that we finished, maybe we head to the back? Yeah. Butterbeer? My brother told me all about this stuff. This shit gets you crazy. a lot of butter beer. Guy nines. Uh, go fish. Yo, it's Benny. Aaron, what's up? What's good, boys? Yo, it's good. Ah, uh, hey, man. <laughs> Yo, bro, how's Penn State? I heard there's some crazy frat parties. <laughs> yeah, why are you wearing that? Are you pledging or something? Yeah. What? I, I don't go to Penn State anymore. I decommitted months ago. I go to Gross's School for the Magically Inclined. You never heard of it? Where is uh, it? Yeah, yeah, I've heard of that. How's Gross's? Uh, it's, like, pretty cool. We learn a lot of interesting stuff. That's dope. Nah, JK, we have crazy parties. Oh, for real? Yeah, you want to see this crazy stuff that I got? 
Oh, butter that. beer. Ooh. Butter beer, boys. You guys want to try some? Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> How's Indiana treating you, bro? Yo, Indiana is so much fun. I love that place. Indiana is number one! Number one! So hot, how's Elon been? I heard that kid Daniel Horgan goes there. Is that true? Yeah, yeah, you know, it turns out he's like low-key really weird. He follows me around and shit, and he always asks me what I'm doing. It's like, I don't know. Yeah, so how's Tulane been? Tulane is crazy. Take so many chops. Breakfast, chop. Lunch, chop. Dinner, more chops. <laughs> Sweet. I love lamb chops. Ryan, how's Syracuse been? Um, I, I got post rejected. Oh yeah. Yeah, but uh, uh Robes, how's your uh, senior year been, man? It's been going pretty well. Hopefully I'll uh, hear back soon and I'll be getting into college. Everyone raise a glass, let's toast to Robes getting into college. touch that, okay? Professor Wumbleson gave this to me. He said to be responsible with it. This is a very dangerous tool, okay? All I'm right. not gonna touch it. Okay. However, I do have some liquid aurelium. Apparently this stuff gets you clapped. No way. How much do I drink? Huh. I'm trying to think. Remember, one drop only. Yeah, I don't think it matters. Just, uh, kind of okay, dump awesome, it in. Awesome, yeah. Atta boy. Now chug. How's it taste? Pretty good. Packs quite a punch, actually. I, I think I need to lie down. It's, it's, oh. must have drank the entire bottle. This stuff is very potent. Pretty sure I told him not to drink the entire thing. Yeah, I don't think it matters. Just uh, kind of okay, dump awesome. it in. Yeah. Oh, uh, no. wait, wait a second. second. Rose! All right, I'm out. Yeah, this robe stuff is crazy, but like, I really gotta go. I'm sorry. Like, I'll see you guys. Crazy, crazy night. Crazy night. Oh my god. Robes, what have I done? Robes! Yo, bro, I think I'm gonna dip, man. Like, this, this is crazy. I can't believe it's all my fault that we turned robes into a dog. Like, wanna help me figure that out? Spenny, you're thinking about this all wrong. There's two ways to think about it. One, he's a dog. Or two, he's a dog, bro. You know what? You got a point. Okay. Yeah. I used to get mad at my school. The teachers who taught me were cool. You're holding me down, turning me around, filling me up with your rules. I got you with me, it's getting better, a little better all the time.
Maybe that's one of Rubes' new friends. Yeah, let's go see. It's nice that Robes is adjusting to his new life. Am I a wizard? Well, you're not a wizard quite yet. 